So I have a video called uh, Those Idiots on the Road or something like that about the anger that uh, we often feel behind the wheel. But a lot of people experience a lot of fear behind the wheel too, or maybe so much fear that they never even allow themselves to get behind a wheel. So uh, if you're in that boat, as opposed to that car, <sighs> tap with me, would you? <laughs> Taking full responsibility for your own well-being. Including what happens after you free yourself to drive. Don't get in an accident and say, it's Brad's fault because he made me feel okay to drive. Anyhow. Even though I have these fears about driving, I choose to love and accept myself anyway. Even though I have these fears about driving, I choose to love and honor myself anyway. Even though I have these fears about driving, sometimes I don't allow myself to drive. And when I do, it's really uncomfortable. And it probably makes me less safe. And even though I have these fears about driving, I choose to deeply and completely love, honor, and accept myself. And anyone else who has contributed to this fear, all these fears about driving, all this fear of driving, All this fear of being behind the wheel. All this fear of being in an accident. All this fear that I'm not a good enough driver. To keep myself safe. Especially when there are so many idiots on the road. I don't feel safe with all these other people. And maybe I doubt my ability. To drive safely. All these fears. All these fears about driving. And I choose to move through them. Part of me doesn't want to. Part of me says I need this fear to keep me safe. But it's robbing me of opportunities. And it makes me very uncomfortable when I drive. Which makes me less safe. I don't need fear to be a safe driver. I don't need fear to be a good driver. I just choose to be a smart driver. And I have it within me to do so. And maybe there's training I need to get. Things I need to do to become a better driver. Things I can do to improve my confidence. And I choose to do that. Clearing this need for fear. I can be smart without fear. Clearing this fear that if I let go of this fear of driving,
I'll put myself in danger. I don't need this fear to be smart. I can be careful without being afraid. And I can handle it. Doing what it takes to become a better driver. Because I choose to be the best driver I can be. I choose to be a safe driver. I choose to be a model driver. The kind of driver that everyone on the road should be. Confident yet safe. I can be a smart driver. And I can relax and even enjoy the experience. Giving myself to permission to relax when I'm driving. Not too much. Just enough to enjoy the experience. I'm getting better and better at driving. Allowing myself to be an excellent and confident driver. And clearing the past. These past experiences that have contributed to this fear. Maybe something bad has happened while I was driving. Or just while I was in the car. And I have this negative association to driving. And I choose to clear this as much as possible. There may have been a lot of reasons those things happened. But I created a generalized fear. And I'm letting that go. becoming a good enough driver that this doesn't happen again. Allowing myself to be the best driver I can be. So that I can be as safe as possible. And I can relax and enjoy driving. I can handle it. Clearing all my doubts about that. Allowing myself to become more and more confident as a driver. In body, mind, and spirit. Take a deep breath. Lather, rinse, repeat as necessary, and you know, do what you can do to give yourself the freedom to experience life to the fullest. Thanks.